Guys, it's time for another fun Lakeview Chamber of Commerce video. This one, I know for a fact you guys are gonna love. So since baseball season just started, Lakeview Chamber of Commerce wants me to go highlight the three most iconic bars in Wrigleyville. This is just a perfect video for me. I like, you guys know, you guys know I love bars. Before we go do that though, you guys are unbelievable. I have to give you guys some super thanks shout outs. This is how many super thanks that I've gotten in the last week. This is crazy. I got a $20 Venmo from David Boyle. Then I got 10 bucks from Alex Husco, five bucks from Derek Boudreaux, 10 bucks from Larry Gonzalez, five bucks from Thomas Corb, two bucks from Derek Boudreaux, 20 bucks from C. Danielson, another $2 from Derek Boudreaux, $10 from Chef Jeff, $5 from Larry Gonzalez, two bucks from Alex Husco, another five bucks from Chef Jeff, five bucks from Chris Catton, 10 bucks from Jeff Schwartz, 10 10 bucks from Larry Gonzalez, two bucks from Derek Woodrow, another five bucks from Chef Jeff, and another five bucks from Alex Husco. You guys, you guys are, you guys are wild. Like, th I can't even, thank you so much. Like, that's incredible. That was like, most of those were from within the last seven days. There were a couple that were like closer to two weeks away, but I mean, I don't, I literally don't deserve you guys. This, let's go, let's go check out these Wrigleyville bars, huh? All right, guys, we are at the first spot today, legendary spot, Sluggers, dude. Which, if you guys, if you guys have been following the channel for a while, I've actually brought you guys here before, a couple years ago, for like my favorite bars around Wrigley. It's kind of round two here. Uh, let's pop in and check it out, huh? First spot, Sluggers, got me a high life, by the way. So this spot's such a classic, it's at 3540 Clark Street. I mean, we're talking less than a minute walk from Wrigley. If I'm doing a video that's about the most iconic Wrigleyville bars, this 100% has to be on the list. First off, it's massive. There are, let's see, you got this main bar that we're in, huge. There's also a back bar. Then upstairs, there's the dueling piano bars, and then all also, there's a place you can buy beer inside the in the game room. It's crazy how many bars are here. And then there's also a massive game room where there's batting cages, a, a bar with batting cages. Think about that. It's so awesome. And then like just every arcade game you can imagine. There's like the basketball shot game. They even have a, like a beer pong game, like ski ball, but beer pong. It's freaking awesome. They also have ski ball. They've got, I mean, just you name it, they got it. Uh, it's an incredible, incredible spot. And they also have like really sizable patio for being in this area so some great outdoor space and then also they, they've got food here all right before we get out of here I gotta take you guys upstairs and show you this game room and like the batting cage stuff it's unbelievable let's uh let's cruise up there Check this place out. So right over my shoulder here, this is the batting cages. We've got skee ball over here. There's some arcade games right there. And this is only the half of it. There's a whole other section back there. I mean, this place is just massive, fun, good times. All right, they'll finish my beer. We gotta go ahead to our next spot. Literally just up the road, like two steps. So let's uh, cruise, we're heading to the Cubby Bear. Guys, we're already at our next spot. It's only like 40 feet up the road. I don't know if you see it right there. We're heading into Cubby Bear. Let's uh, let's go check it out. Alright, guys. 
guys, we're at the second spot, Cubby Bear. Got myself a Miller Lite, that's right. And check this out, Cubby Bear has some delicious wings. Look how tasty these things look. All right, we gotta try these wings. Look at these things. Whoa, look at that. Mm, mm, mm -hmm. Oh, these are so good. So, a few things about Cubby Bear. It's got 1059 Ashton. Um, if you want to know where Cubby Bear's at, it's literally in, uh, like across the street from the uh, from Wrigley Field. Here, I'll show you. Check it out. You see that? So yeah, you don't really need the address for this place. Just go to Wrigley and there it is. You can see some really fun bands here. I read Dave Grohl's book and the first concert he ever went to was actually here. So if you, if you come here, keep a lookout for like uh, some uh, like Dave Grohl pictures and they have like a set list here. They have a couple things from him. These wings are so good. So yeah, you can come here and catch shows all the time. It's huge. They got this great bar here. Directly behind me on the other side, another massive huge bar. It's a huge space. There's also this second room like up a few steps where there's another bar. So I mean it's like this place they can fill up but you're you're gonna find space and you're gonna be able to grab a beer. Slam them, slam these wings. Alright guys, I'm gonna finish this beer and head to the last spot for the day. Murphy's bleachers. It's just on the other side of Wrigley, so here we go. Guys, we're at the last spot, Murphy's Bleachers. I mean, it doesn't get much more iconic than this. You might recognize it from turkey bowling video that we just did a few weeks ago. Anyways, let's pop in and go check it out. All right, last spot of the day, Murphy's. Murphy's Bleachers is phenomenal. Also, Bush Light, I'm pretty stoked about that. I don't see Bush Light cans at too many places. So Murphy's at 3655 Sheffield, right across the street from Wrigley. This place has so many bars. There's the front bar, the middle bar, the back bar, and then it's closed right now, but they have an outdoor space that also, there's a bar. I think the bar back that way is in like an old police station too or something like that. This place is just such a classic spot. I've actually featured it twice. Like I said, the turkey bowling, which is just a few weeks ago. And then Murphy's was also in another video I did like two years ago of like my favorite bars in like the Wrigleyville area, which if you haven't seen that, you should go check it out. It has a pretty classic opening with a guy just doing this crazy, a crazy person making some tunes. Anybody else Bush Light fans? I love a good light beer. Another fun fact about this spot, me and Sean actually filmed a really fun Captain Morgan event here that we got invited to and they released some sort of new drink many, many moons ago. Early, early, early number six with cheese. Actually, now that I think about it, I filmed a lot of fun videos here. Also, this bar's been around since Prohibition. It was actually called Ernie's Bleachers back in the 30s. Uh, but yeah, it's been the Murphy's Bleachers since like, I wanna say the 80s. So yeah, this spot's been here a long time. This, is, this place has seen some stuff. Man, I slammed through this bush light. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna get out of here, guys. I hope you guys like this. All these bars are awesome. These are the iconic spots to go to if you're going to a Cubs game this season. So I hope you check them out. I'll catch you guys next week for another video. Peace. Yeah, I know uh, Lakeview Chamber of Commerce actually hires me to uh, make like sh videos for them since baseball se season starting. The most iconic Wrigleyville bars. So today I'm going to three different bars. So yeah, it's fun stuff. My name's Andy. Oh, cool. I'm nice to meet you. Of course. Of Logan Square Chamber of Commerce. Oh, no like, kidding. Send me some shit. Tell yeah, I baseball. will. That's awesome. I just met a guy who's a uh, vice president of another chamber of commerce and saw me making videos. Wants me to send him uh, some of my stuff. Small world, huh? <laughs>